Fuck, I just stabbed myself with a needle. These patients have all contracted an exploding virus that'll have to be extracted and deleted for them to survive. I'm performing emergency surgery immediately. We have four patients today. Jimmy, Nathan, Emily, and Jordan. The exploding virus inside these patients is most likely to detonate the longer it's been inside them. My goal is to extract all four viruses before any of the ghost peppers explode. I'm performing an emergency ultrasound to see how much the virus has evolved. I can see the virus. Oh no, it's worse than I thought. These viruses will detonate within the next hour. Steve, get the bomb squad on standby. Count backwards from 10. I'm performing an x-ray to see which patient's virus is most likely to explode. Looks like all four of them are infected. Seems pretty dangerous for all of them. Oh no, Jimmy woke up! I'm giving him three more milliliters of propofol. Jimmy, go back to sleep! It's not working. I'm giving Jimmy an epidural since he won't stay asleep. <sighs> Jimmy will have to stay awake during surgery. There's the virus. Oh God, it could explode at any minute. Yeah, gross. I believe in the virus. Yo, Emily was eating something really sus. What is this? Oh no, there's a blood vessel crossing the operative field. I'll use forceps to block off and ligate the blood vessel. I'm cauterizing the blood vessel to prevent loss of blood. Now that the blood vessel's out of the way, we can remove the third virus. Wow, good thing it exploded after we got it out of the patient. We got him out just in time. Looks like we have three virus samples to send to the lab and one sus slime sample. Steve, take these specimens to the lab for further research. I'm just making sure the virus didn't leave any leftover infection. I'm flushing the incision and administering an antibiotic just in case.
Antibiotics don't work for viruses, but this will just make sure any bacteria that got inside the wound will be taken care of. Ah! Fuck, I just stabbed myself with a needle. <laughs> this went in so far, too. Hopefully I don't staple myself. Yo, Jimmy, I can't believe you were awake this whole time. Oh no! Oh God, not again. They're going into V-Fib. Clear. We saved Nathan. Going again. Clear. Steve, charge again. 200. Clear. Steve, go one more time. Clear. Charge to 300. Come on, Emily. She's not responding. Give me 300. Clear. We can't slow down on the chest compressions. <sighs> we're too late. Steve, take these patients to the ICU to recover. There's nothing we can do for Emily. Steve, take these remains to Emily's family. 